right, everybody, welcome back for another episode. We've got a lot to get to here. There's been a lot of world records set, and let's kick this off with one by Julius Maddox on the bench press. This here was a 765 pound attempt, uh, which would give him the unofficial world record. Press. Right. All right, that was a nice clean lift. Good job, Julius. And the guy in the background just doing abs, doesn't even care. Okay. And we have even more Julius here, this time in competition. Uh, his first attempt is 700 pounds. And now it's time to go for the world record. Julius Maddox with a 770 pound bench press. at a different angle. And he is pumped. And he should be. Well done. Congratulations to Julius. This is Thomas Davis here, who was also able to secure a 700 pound lift. And he became the sixth man ever to do this lift. Crazy that you bench 700 pounds and you're not even the best bencher in the room. And 2018 World's Strongest Man, Hafthor Bjornsson, set another world record while training for the 2020 Arnold Strongman Classic this past weekend. This time with a bar bending deadlift of 480 kilograms or 1,058 pounds on the elephant bar. Hafthor was able to continue his success in competition at the Arnold Classic where he was able to nail a solid 1,026 pound lift. This helped Thor to earn another World's Strongest Man title and a cool $72,000 for his efforts. So big congratulations to Thor. And Larry Wills is back putting out more world record numbers. Larry was able to break Eric Lillybridge's total record with 2,370 pounds or 1,058 kilograms total. Larry was able to complete a 870 pound squat, a 645 bench, and an 855 pound deadlift. Jamal Browner continues to impress, this time deadlifting 455 kilograms or 1,003 pounds on the Mammoth Bar. Alright, for our next world record we have Kevin Oak here squatting 860 pounds and a 242 pound weight class. This is a raw lift and uh, congratulations to Kevin. Yeah. 
right, and here we have another world record, this time by Tom Stolman, who destroyed Brian Shaw's record at the Stone Over Bar by over 40 pounds. Here's Tom with a 602 pound stone lift. Wow. All right, we have another world record here, this time by Jessica Butner here at the Canadian Powerlifting Championships where she performed a 463 pound squat. And Jessica wasn't done there. She also managed a gigantic 551 pound deadlift, which broke the current IPF record by over 17 pounds. This combined with her 225 pound bench press led her to secure an unofficial world record total lift of 1,240 pounds. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Here's another incredible lift by Hafthor Bjornsson again, this time lifting 220 pound dumbbells for a new personal record of six reps. Note there's nobody here to hand him these weights either, which is typically done with this kind of weight. Uh, for perspective, Eddie Hall performed the same weight in his prime for seven reps, but the weights were handed to him, so. Uh, this is just crazy. Nice. Alright, next we have another world record here again by Jamal Browner. Uh, this is a 971 pound lift or 440 kilograms. This is an all time world record in the 242 pound class. And boy, did he make that look easy. And next we have Samantha Eugenie here. She's preparing for the Nationals coming up. She hits a nice PR deadlift here at 216 kilograms or 476 pounds uh, with a body weight of only 63 kilograms. And she's only 17 years old, so bright future ahead here for Samantha. Come on, Daniela. This is Daniela Mello, and here she is attempting a 500-pound squat. Blaine Sumner is regarded as one of the world's strongest powerlifters. At the Arnold Sports Festival, Blaine secured an incredible 1,135-pound squat world record. Biggest squat in IPF history. Wow, look at that. That walkout is so I gotta scary. Go yeah. Come on, Blaine. I'd say that's, that's as in. Oh, was. yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. I think he's got it. Oh, wow. That's a lot of weight. <laughs> All right. Daniel Bell put on quite a performance at the Sarasota Showdown where he lifted a massive 2,485 pound or 1,127.5 kilogram total, which was enough to break the all-time world record total in sleeves. This was done only three months after he broke the all-time world record in reps. So Daniel had a, a 1,003 pound or 455 kilogram squat, a 578 pound or 282.5 kilogram bench, and a 410 kilogram or 903 pound deadlift. Good job, Daniel. that's it for today I hope you guys enjoyed the video if you guys managed to uh, make it all the way through the video you guys kick ass give me a thumbs up and uh, see you in the next one thanks
Pedro. <laughs>